About 100 teenage girls descended on Dublin City University for the Girls Hack Ireland Hackathon, which taught novices and improvers the skills needed to manipulate web pages and build whole websites from scratch. There were prizes on offer for the winning teams, but the spirit of the day was about nurturing the next generation of female coders. So Jennifer, tell us a bit about the project that you're working on here. Uh, we're just hacking into the BBC Irish website and just changing it into all Irish music and culture and stuff like that. So Esley, tell us a little bit about the project that you're working on here. Um, our project is about Newest Ireland. So we're talking about the modern way of Ireland and things that people wouldn't really know that goes on in Ireland, like, and the culture and everything like that, yeah, and tourism. Brilliant, and how are you going about doing that? Well, we have to make a HTML code that will start off the starter page, and then we have to make six other pages. So one of us are working on the code, and one's working with music and images, and then we're going to have content page. So we're all divided up so we can make it faster process. Yeah. That's great, you've lots of work to do. And are you having fun doing it? Yeah, it's a very interesting thing. Have you ever done anything like this before? Um, I did. Um, I'm in a co computer science program in Trinity with my school every Monday type thing and it's kind of different because you're actually making your website but over there we make games and stuff so it's kind of similar but not really yeah and is it something you'd continue to do you're really interested in uh, continuing doing computer science yeah i'd probably do engineering or computer science in a language ellen tell us a bit about your project that you're working on here um we're just doing uh we've gone onto the cia uh, website and we're all doing a different page in it and we're kind of changing it so it's not about it's about ireland but it's just from if Americans were writing about it, like writing about different stuff and how Ireland has kind of gone off the rail and different stuff about it. And what part are you working on? I'm currently working on uh, Irish teens and youth, doing like a page up on that. So that's, um, that's just like different weird rumours and sort of like what it's like to be a teenager in Ireland. I'm doing the homepage at the moment. We're just kind of making it a little bit ridiculous but fun at the same time so that we're saying is Ireland even real and can you find leprechauns things like that but it's just been St Paddy's Day so we can like incorporate a lot of that kind of stuff it's really great so you've got a bit of sense of humour going on yeah definitely that's great do you think you've got a winning project here I hope so I mean it's pretty funny but I don't think it's going to be better than that <laughs> so you're having fun today yeah definitely